guys, welcome to the new weekly vlog. I apologise for this spot on my cheek. Um, today is Monday as usual and me and Alana are having quite an exciting day actually. We're going to get some tattoos later and I'm not gonna lie, I'm really scared but hopefully it'll be okay. I'm gonna get a water lily on my ankle. Some people might, well it does also look like a lotus flower but I'm gonna say it's a water lily because it's like my favourite flower and yeah that's what i'm getting um yeah that's gonna be exciting i haven't got much else planned to be honest we're going i need to do some work because we've got a deadline on wednesday and i haven't started that deadline yet it's to um write a script can't remember if i said that in the last vlog but yeah we need to write a script about either fear love or loss so i need to think of a story and everything still and write that today and tomorrow to hand it in on wednesday um I also need to tidy my room because I went home this weekend so I've kind of got my suitcase out on my floor <laughs> so I need to tidy all that up um, and yeah I think while we um, when we go for our tattoos we might go into town for a bit and that's what we're doing today so I need to like shower and stuff and I'll see you later guys hi guys so it's like quarter past three and we've got like 45 minutes until we leave and I'm so so scared I've got something on my face um yeah I'm really scared but hopefully it'll be fine um I wanted to try and show you my tattoo let me just try and show you one second so on Pinterest I found this board of like loads of different water lilies and lotus flowers and I really liked this one here at first I liked this one but then I thought this I liked this little middle bit in this one and that's on my Pinterest board. If you want to follow me on Pinterest, I don't even know what my- Sorry guys, my um, phone just ran out of storage, but if you want to follow me on Pinterest, I'm pretty sure it's just Sarah Mule, to be honest with you. There. And these are my boards. And I have a whole board of tattoos. There. So yeah, I think we're gonna go now. Exciting and really scared. Hey guys, so I haven't vlogged in a while because I haven't been doing much, just been sitting chatting in the kitchen, but I just came in to Alana's room so we could clean our tattoos and because I like took off the cling film and stuff, I thought I'd show it to you and hang on, I'm just going to flip over the camera. Here it is. There you go. Cute. It's a little water lily and I absolutely love it. I like that he could do it, liked that he could do it so small for me. And the little line. Yeah. So yeah, I really love it. I'm so happy with it. I also have taken mine off. I'll show you like this actually. Here it is. I'll try not to show you my boob. <laughs> it's a bit red around the edges at the moment. But yeah, there it is. And these marks are from my bikini, so. Love it though. Looks so cute. We just need to put the, another dressing on them. Yeah. No. We've just cleaned them. You just we got like a little letter information thing on how to clean Cleaning your tattoo. instructions. Yeah, and I'm just so happy with it. Like I love it so much, and I like that I can like hide it, and it's just quite small. So, yeah, love it. Let's dress them now. Woohoo! Hey guys, so it is Tuesday morning, and sorry I didn't vlog much yesterday. Actually, I didn't vlog at all. But obviously we filmed our tattoos and that was it that I vlogged because I don't know why I just literally didn't pick up my camera I mean my phone 
and vlog at all but yeah I think I was just tired <laughs> but anyway yeah yesterday we got our tattoos and we love them so much and I've just had a shower that's why my hair's wet and cared for my tattoo I'm just gonna show you it again here it is it's so pretty I just love it so much I'm so happy I showed my mum so she wouldn't find out from this vlog so I thought I'd tell her before she watched my vlog and she likes it so that's a good sign um, just put some bapanthum on it and I'm gonna go have some pancakes in a minute I was gonna do something else oh I just did an order from Topshop because they've got 20% off at the moment for students and I've got um, well I had uh, Topshop vouchers for my birthday so I bought some shorts a dress and a skirt but there I did them to order to the store so I think they're coming on like Friday to the store so I'll get them then and I'll show you then and I'll probably try them on in the shop I did that so I ordered them to the shop so that I could try them on in the shop because the shops are only like 10 minute walk away so then I can try them on in the shop and then if I don't want it I can just give it straight back and get my money back straight away but I'm pretty sure I'll like them I didn't know what to spend my money on because like I wanted to spend it on summer clothes because I'm going on holiday and I also wanted to spend it because they were 20% off but I have so many tops already and so yeah I'm glad I found what I found and one of the skirts that I bought is in the sale and I tried it on like a couple of weeks ago and I really liked it but I didn't buy it now it's in the sale so I bought it so I'm excited for them to come I've also got my Grey's box I used to um, order Grey's box and then I stopped it when I came to uni but I've just ordered another well the other day I started ordering them again because I've got a job now so I was like well I can afford three pounds every two weeks or something for another Grey's box because I really like getting them because quite often at uni I'm like I want a snack but I don't want something unhealthy and now I can just have a little grey snack so it's actually perfect and I think I'll really need it even though I could do with more like like one a week or something but I can't afford that <laughs> right now so I need to go get that at two but we can only get our mail from two o'clock to seven o'clock and it's like twelve o'clock now so I'm gonna have to wait a couple hours so I'm having pancakes instead which isn't that healthy either but okay, well they're pancakes I had to use my eggs up so I'm gonna go into the kitchen and get and have some pancakes. I think Jack is gonna make them. So I'll see you in a bit. Hi guys, so I only woke up about like 20 minutes ago and I've just come into Lana's room to see her and I've just cleaned my tattoo because I oh I she on. Um I like slept with it wrapped up in cling film just because that's what the piece of paper said to do. So I did it and it went all like jelly so <laughs> I just cleaned it and put some papanthan on it I'll show you it still looking good and I still love it it looks a bit all like shiny and stuff because I just put the nappy cream on it but I just love it so much last night Alana uploaded our um, last week's weekly vlog so we just need to make a thumbnail for that today and today we also need to just write script write our script that's due in tomorrow like all day so that'll be exciting um and yeah i don't know how exciting today's gonna be because we're just doing work and stuff but i'll keep you updated and i need to have a shower and stuff but i'm just gonna wait for Lana to come to come back because she just let sonia and her dad in to um here to our little accommodation place so yeah i'll talk to you later guys Hey guys, so um, Alana's boyfriend Jack just texted her saying It's snowing We just looked outside And it is It is snowing <laughs> Let me show you see it, but... I can't tell Maybe it stopped Okay, a minute ago it was definitely snowing It was, we swear <laughs> It's nearly May guys Oh my god, I can't believe it's nearly May <laughs> And it's snowing It's only just April I swear it wasn't even that cold outside It's not cold enough yeah, to snow Yeah, he said not anymore that's so weird. Hi guys. So the time is like two o'clock, I think. I don't know. Um, and we're just looking at holiday homes because yes. I don't know if I've mentioned it like ever, but we were going to go on holiday to Cornwall with our friends from home. I feel like I have yeah, mentioned or that Devon. somewhere. Yeah. 
But they're so expensive! But basically, <laughs> you have to have someone over 21 in the room and none of us are 21, so we can't go there. Which is a bit stupid, because like, in the UK, when you're 18, you're an adult. Yeah, so. you're allowed to drink. You're allowed to go everywhere else. Do stuff. Yeah. This so. is not Vegas. I don't get it. It's only Devon. But yeah, Ooh. so we can't really stay there. Um, so we're looking at other places, but they're all really expensive because our budget is like a hundred pounds. Yeah, we're only going for three nights, but like places are just expensive these days. We still haven't written our scripts. No, due in tomorrow. Don't know what to write. It's all right. Hopefully, it just won't take long. I'm just assuming it's going to be fine. Yeah. Hopefully, it'll only take like two hours ish. No, not Trivago. Wish I didn't have this spot on my cheek. Look at it. Yes. What a shame. It is. Um, so, got nothing else to say anymore, so I'll talk to you later. Bye. Hey guys, I just got my Grey's box and it looks very cute. <laughs> very cute. So you've got a banana on the back. I'm just going to show you what's inside. Always found them a pain to get off. So I've got cheddar gorge, which has cheese flavored cashews, croutons, and herb crackers. Yummy. Jaffa cake flapjack, which is really good. It's like orange chocolate flapjack, basically. Zesty lime and red pepper salsa with wholemeal pita chips, which looks great. I haven't had that one before. And the last one is. Chocolate pretzel pop, poppy seed pretzels, sweet and salty half popped corn, and milk chocolate drops. Yummy! I'm gonna eat one now, I think. Actually, I'm not that hungry. I might have one though. I don't know which one, because they all look great. If you guys want a code, Four. well, I don't know if it's great spots, but now. it says Alana 6TB. So that's my code if you want one. Bye for now. Hey guys, I'm just writing my script and it's actually a loads easier than I thought it was gonna be. Like once I've started, I've done, I've done 425 words, which isn't loads, but I have a spot on my lip by the way. Um, which isn't loads, but um, like I've just started basically and it's going quite quickly, so that's good. So yeah, it's going to be fine, I think. The story might not be great, but I can't honestly think of a story right now. But I think I'm writing it pretty well, so that's good. And hopefully the story is fine. But yeah, me and Jack, well, Jack's decided he, oh no, he hasn't decided. What am I going on about? Jack's just been given a job as a photographer at a nightclub, like officially now. So we're going out for dinner tonight to celebrate, I guess. We're going to Ed's Diner and they've got a 50% off at the moment. Well, they sent me a code for it. I don't know if it's a like global thing. Um, so yeah, we're going there tonight, which is exciting. And it's half five now, so we're gonna be going at like half six, seven-ish, I think. It's so sunny outside. It's so weird, it was snowing earlier. And now look at the, the sun. Look at it blaring in. But yes, this is such a, it's not even a spot, it's just like a, I don't know, I don't know what it is. There was like a black head there and I squeezed it and, and now it's gone all like puffy, I think. So, well done me. Um, lovely, oh. Just gone into the loom. That's so weird. Okay. So yeah, I'll see you later guys. Bye. So guys, here's my script. <laughs> oh, it's really nice. Yeah, so do I. I really need the toilet. Um, I have done six pages now, and it's terrible. <laughs> I've done like five and a half pages, but I'm trying to think of a plot twist. But I feel like I've left it too late to put a plot twist in because I've only got two and a half pages left that I can write, and I might be able to do it. But all the ones that I've thought of is like, well, that's going to take up another like three pages probably. <laughs> Oh, yeah, basically in mine, I had a woman that had agoraphobia, which is like, she's too scared to go outside. 
and then her mum was gonna die so she like ran to go and see her mum and then she got hit by a car and now she's dead that's the end I don't know what else to write now so that'll do I've done six pages it has to be six to eight pages but it's honestly so boring to read um so yeah I haven't updated you in a while but it's just because I've been writing six pages of a really boring script and I'm probably gonna have dinner soon because I'm really hungry and I need to um wash my tattoo as well because I haven't washed it since I had a shower this morning so I thought I'd just update you and sorry it's been quite a boring day but I haven't really done anything because we made up this word of us. Oh, I found the key! It was in my grace box. <laughs> I just looked at my grace box. Just said Jack a Snapchat like this. <laughs> <coughs> well. Hey guys, um, I'm just going to bed now because, sorry about my face by the way, I just started to take off my makeup on my nose. So my nose looks really red compared to the rest of me because I haven't done, really taken off my eye makeup yet. Um, yeah, it's half past 12 and found the key, luckily, but I'm going to have to go let Jack in at like half two when he comes back in. So I'm going to go to sleep and then he's going to ring me and I normally wake up, so let's hope I do. At half two I'm going to be like, oh, but it was my own fault because I lost the key, but I didn't lose it. It was right on my desk, I just forgot where I put it. I have a dry patch on my neck. Anyway, I'm going to say goodnight now and I'm just going to take the rest of my makeup off. You was in my new micellar water, which I'm loving. And off to sleep I go. So good night guys, and I'll see you for tomorrow's day. Night. Hello guys, so I just thought I'd let you know that I'm just about to go to bed. It's quite late now, it's like half past 12, and I'm just watching Britain's Got Talent here on my laptop. And yeah, I'll see you in the morning. I've got work tomorrow at two, but um, I don't really have anything else planned. I need to submit my script that I've written and yeah, I'll just see you in the morning guys. Good night. Hey guys, we're just going to the tattoo shop because Jack's getting his tattoo today. Did it all in one week. Look at us go. So yeah, we're just going off now. It's um, one o'clock-ish. His tattoo's at half one. He's getting a wave on his wrist. I can't remember if I told you the other day. But yeah. So I had some breakfast, had some granola, yogurt and raspberries, and it was really good. So I will film in the shop. Hi guys, so welcome to Wednesday's vlog and today I've got work and I'm just leaving in a minute. I'm working two till five, no not two till five, that'd be nice wouldn't it? Um, two till seven, so five hours and I'll talk to you after that I guess. I've got no plans except from work. Oh I need to um, hand in an essay later. Um, that's due in at 10 but I'll probably hand it in before 10. I've written it I just want to like go through it and maybe change some bits. So yeah I'm literally gonna go to work now so I'll just see you afterwards. <laughs> Hey guys, so we're back from the tattoo shop. I think I haven't vlogged since then. Um, after we went to get Jack's tattoo, we just went to McDonald's, but I only got a drink because I wasn't hungry. Because this morning I had breakfast. Um, I also just had a cookie because I bought a cookie from Subway earlier and I just ate it, which is bad and not healthy, but it's just a cookie, so whatever. Um, I just finished my script, writing my script, I had like basically done last night, I just needed to like do the ending, so I just done that and I'm not submitting it yet, I've got till 10pm tonight to submit it, 
So I'm going to read over it again in like an hour when my mind's off of it and like double check it and everything. But I'm going to do that in a bit because I have finished it and I'm pretty sure I don't need to change much. Um, so now I'm just lying on my bed. I'm watching a video at the moment and then I'm just going to tidy my room. It's quite, it's not that messy, but I'm just going to put some stuff away that needs putting away. Sorry, I'm just covering this light up with my hair because it keeps blurring on my face. Um... So yeah, I'm going to tidy my room, and then have I got anything else to do? I've probably got a couple things I need to do, so I'll get doing them. I'm not really sure though what I have to do. There was definitely- oh, I need to call the doctors. And that's all, so I'll catch up with you in a bit. Hi guys, so I'm back from work and it's like quarter past nine now and I'm just cooking, there's some chicken, there's some potatoes, yay, and there's some vegetables. I'm going to make a, I don't know what it is, I've just made it up, it's like a stew thing because I'm going to just cut up all this chicken and all my veg and all my potatoes and mix it all in with some tomato sauce and just eat that. I don't think it will be nice. Um, work was fun, it went quite quickly, so that was okay. And now, me and Alana are just inquiring about going away to Devon with our friends from home. We are indeed. We've found a cute little little cottage. <laughs> <laughs> little cottage called the Badger Cottage. Yeah. In Devon slash Cornwall, I don't know which one. I think it's in Devon. Oh, okay. Well, it's imbued, but actually, it might be Cornwall, I'm not sure. So, yeah, we're going to go there with our friends and it looks really nice. And I'll show you my dinner when it's done because I just need to concentrate with timing right now. You're right, Jack. <laughs> I made my stew, guys, thing, and it tastes really good, but it doesn't look very nice. And I've tried it and you think it looks nice? Yeah. Well, thank you. <laughs> I've tried it and it's really good, so I'm going to finish eating it now. Hey guys, I'm just making dinner and I've decided to make these sweet potato patty patties basically that I found on the internet. But I'm doing them with sweet potato even though the recipe's for normal potato because I don't have normal potatoes. Um, and they look really good. Currently they look like this. It's just mashed sweet potato, onion, garlic, spinach and salt and pepper which I've just cooked. <laughs> and now I need to add some breadcrumbs, lemon juice, and it says parmesan cheese, but I don't have any, so I don't think I'm gonna add any, because I reckon they'll still taste good. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna do now. Add the rest of the mixture. I have made some patties. The first couple didn't turn out, well, they actually look fine. They taste good, but they fell apart. I think they are. They taste really good, sort of sweet potato, basically, in patty form. And I'm cooking some more, and hopefully these will be better because they're on a lower heat and I was being too impatient and cooking them on a high heat. Nah. Yeah. Hi guys, so it's Thursday today and I have uni, all kind of, I've got like another meeting with a teacher just like I did last week and then I think me and my group are going to do some filming in a wedding shop because basically we've got to make a small documentary and our, do our documentary idea is to do a documentary about wedding traditions so we've gone to like um, a wedding shop that's here in Southampton we're just gonna film some cute little shots in there and I'm just gonna grab some breakfast and then I'm gonna go so I don't know how much I'll film at uni I might film a bit for you but yeah I'll talk to you later Hey guys, um, please excuse my hair, it's a bit wet at the moment because I just, basically I can't be bothered to wash my hair so I just like washed my roots because they're greasy. 
but I've just got back from finishing my studio show, my final studio show. It's one that Sarah filmed like a couple of weeks ago, but my group's just filmed our final one. And it went really well. We did three takes and I didn't film any because I completely forgot to be honest. And also because it was the final one, our director was like, just don't go on your phones and like concentrate because it had to go right basically. So I didn't want to get distracted and then miss my cue or something. So I didn't film, but I probably could have, but yeah, I forgot. So sorry about that. Um, the studio show is going to go on YouTube though, so I'll put a link below when it's up there. But it probably won't be for another week or so. Because it, need, it might need editing, I'm not sure. But basically that's all my Thursday sessions done. So now I've got nothing on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday. I've only got Friday at, at uni, I'm pretty sure. I need to confirm it. I think we might have one more Thursday session in a couple weeks just to go through everything because we have to write an essay about our um, studio show that we've just done so we might have to go in again for that but after that that's everything done and then on Fridays so we've only got that essay and filming a drama which we're doing next Wednesday we were meant to do it this week but we need to do it we're all free and we can't do it till next Wednesday but that's fine because it's not due in for another two weeks so we'll have another week to edit it which is fine so that'll go well hopefully and then after that we've literally done everything so I'm gonna try and get that essay done um, for like then so I literally am finished the day that the drama's due in because that's also the day that I'm well it's not the day I go to Ibiza but I'm in Ibiza that day so it would be nice to have everything done before I go to Ibiza so I do have enough time to do my essay so I might as well actually just do it to be honest normally I don't do things till like a few days before because I work better then but I might as well just do it because then I'll have it done and I've got loads of time but I'm gonna try and get some overtime at work because that gives me money um I have got work today actually at four it's currently probably like two maybe just before two because we went to the the, uh, the student union bar after our studio show because it was the final one so we went and the boys all like got drinks but I just got cranberry juice because didn't want to drink any alcohol at two o'clock to be honest so yeah um I'm just gonna chill for a bit until work basically no one's in at the moment well Sarah and Jack aren't in and the other girls are at home so the boys might be in I'm not really sure who's here to be honest so, I'm just going to chill because I have nothing to do. I'm just eating this cheese like margarita twist thing that I got from the co-op because um, I was really really hungry because I haven't eaten anything today. So I just got this after uni because I couldn't be able to make anything. But I'm going to need to eat something again so I'm going to eat something proper before I go to work. So that I feel fine at work and not don't get hungry. I'm at work from four till half eight, which is fine. And then I'm in uni tomorrow from one till five, but it's normally like one till three. Recently, it's only been like one till half four. We've only been, I mean, one till half two. We've only been in for like an hour, an hour and a half because we're literally just checking in with our lecturer and doing our assignment outside the lesson. So we're not really in uni that much so yes i'm gonna eat this watch some videos and i'll get back to you hi guys so i'm back from uni and i've actually got a little bit of a headache but i've had some paracetamol so hopefully that'll go in a minute um i've decided i'm gonna make some cookies because i feel like it but i'm gonna make granola cookies because i've got a lot of granola and i keep not eating it so i thought oh they might be good with some cookies so i found a recipe and I'm just going to make these now. I might show you as I'm making them so you can follow along. And if you want to make them, you can. They're just chocolate chip granola cookies because I've got this granola. Let me show you. This Jordan's Country Crisp chocolate one. So hopefully that will be nice. And hopefully this goes well because I've never made granola cookies before, but they sounded quite nice. So. Yeah, I'll just get all the ingredients out and talk to you when I'm making them. I'm just kind of guessing this recipe because I don't have any scales, so 
You need flour, sugar, brown sugar, but I don't have that, so I'm not using it. Um, baking soda. I've got baking powder, hopefully they're similar. Salt, um, vanilla. I got vanilla extract out, but it doesn't say to use that, but I thought it would taste nicer. Granola and an egg. I don't have any eggs, and Alana's at work, but I know she has eggs, so I'm going to use some of her eggs and I'll just pay her back because... I want to make these cookies <laughs> so hopefully this goes well and let me put you somewhere so I'll do like a little time lapse of this so you can watch me make the cookies turned out to be successful but I haven't tried one yet but I've got to go and film at uni now so I'm going to take one with me and I'll let you know if they're nice. Hi guys so um, I don't really remember when I last spoke to you I think it was when I was um, making cookies but since then I've been out to film some stuff for a for our school documentary or our uni documentary which is um, about wedding traditions and I'll insert some clips of that here. was really fun I loved looking at all the dresses it was just so much fun because I've never really been in a wedding shop to look at dresses before but I wasn't there to look at the dresses but you know when you're in there you just can't help it because they're all so pretty um I've just been to the co-op to buy some unhealthy snacks because I ran out of snacks but I thought I'd show you what I bought anyway I ran out of bread so I just brought bought some bread this is the King's Mill white Danish because it was 75p I bought some crisps, which are sensations, roasted chicken and thyme, or thyme, I don't know how you say that, I think it's thyme. Some Maryland soft bakes. Some brunch bars, because I like these for, oh I got well scared, I bought the raisin ones then. Um, I like to have these for breakfast. Oh my god, then, oh no, let me show you this first. I just got some dark chocolate because Alana bought this dark chocolate a while ago and it was well good. And the last thing is the best thing in the world. I got two packs of party rings for a pound. Two packs. These are normally like £1.25 for one pack. And I was like, oh my god, best moment ever. So yeah, that's all the stuff I bought. And I'm just going to eat something of this now. I think I'm going to eat a bit of the dark chocolate because I can't have any pudding. For dinner, I just had a frozen pizza because I really need to go on a food shop because I've got like no vegetables or meat or potato. I've just got nothing in right now, really. And yeah, that's what I'm going to do now. Hey guys, um, so it's Friday now and I'm just having my breakfast even though it's like... Half two. <laughs> I thought it was like one o'clock. <laughs> Apparently not. Um, I've already like had a shower and everything, but this isn't really my breakfast. It's my lunch, but I'm having a breakfast for lunch. I've got granola, <clears throat> Greek yogurt, raspberries, some syrup because my honey's gone hard and I don't know why, and some chia seeds. Looks yummy. So I'm excited to eat that because I haven't eaten anything yet and I'm really hungry. 
So I'm going to eat this now. Um, I need to go to town in a bit to pick up a Topshop order that I ordered the other day. But I ordered it to the store because I want to try the stuff on. And then um, if I don't want anything, I can just take it straight back. Because I'll already be in the store. So I've got that to do today. And that's all I have to do. But I might make some pretzels later. Because I bought some yeast last week and I still haven't made my pretzels. Hello everybody, we're just off to town in a second to pick up my Topshop order and we also need some bananas and I want a bowl because I've got a bowl but I used to have two and I smashed one but I want like a wider bowl, I just want one, don't know why. Um, so yeah we're going in about five minutes probably and um, I don't have anything to say. Bye. Hey guys, um, I'm back in my bedroom, but I wasn't actually in my bedroom, I just came in here to show you my Topshop order. So I just picked that up, but we also went to look for a bowl and I couldn't find one, but here's a random montage of John Lewis because they had some cool summery stuff in, so I'm just going to put that in now. Um, so I'm going to show you what I got at ah! Okay, so I just dropped my phone and it stopped recording But I'll show you now and I'm going to try them on in a minute too So I'll show you that in the mirror First thing I got is this dress And this is from Topshop but it's not the actual Topshop brand It's by Glamorous range And it's a petite one because I've got petites Because sometimes dresses are too long and it's just like ties up here, which is really cute. And then it's got this like tassely, tribally detailing. And it just looks like this. The material's thin and like, shh, I think it'll probably be. Oh, it's got a under, it's got two layers, so it won't be see through. That's good. So this looks cute. I'm really excited to try that on. Next, I got this skirt, and I wanted this a while ago, but now it's in sale, so. I got this, it was £20, looks very cute, you can try that on too, and lastly I got these shorts, and I think these look really cool, they've just got this like neon pink, well neon like corally colour design, and these little cut out, it's like a grill design, I don't know. And hopefully these will make me look more tanned when I'm on holiday. If I get tanned, but hopefully I will. So I'm just going to try them on now. Hello everyone. I'm just going to put the light on, the other light, because it's a bit dark. Let's put my lamp somewhere. Hello. Um, so, I just been to Tesco's, well, like an hour ago. Um, but I haven't, I was going to do a little like show you what I got, it's only a few things because I want to first up I've got two pita breads and they're like large ones and I don't eat these that often but I would if I had some so these would reduce to 24p because they go out of date today but I'm just going to freeze them next I got a garlic flatbread, garlic and cheese flatbread and I like making pizzas on these and I wanted to do one soon but that was a pound uh, next I got some almond milk because I really wanted to try it for ages and it was on offer so I just bought some it's um, this one unsweetened one and I hope it's nice I'm gonna maybe put some like in my porridge or whatever else I can use this for Mm -hmm. 
I got this little thing of sushi because it was reduced to 68p and it's just smoked salmon and cucumber and I might actually eat that now even though I need to cook dinner but it's only tiny. I got some sour cream in a um, tube because this lasts longer than like the fresh one. I can have this in the fridge for 14 days. Normally, oh that's in front of the lens, normally you can only have them for like three days. I've got one baking potato, one avocado, and a bag of sweet potatoes. And for dinner, I think I'm just going to have some, some chips, I'm just going to make some. Maybe some normal chips, maybe some sweet potato chips, I'm not sure yet. I'm excited because I am really hungry. I might just have some chips and have some sushi now, so I'll be full from that. Hey guys, we're just in the taxi. We're going we out spontaneously. I haven't vlogged yet because I worked. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and we've got Taxi Man. What's your name, Taxi Man? What? Nimson. <laughs> and our friends. Just coming. Sonia fell down the stairs. Sonia's just coming. <laughs> Sonia just fell down the stairs, but she's fine, guys. Don't worry. Laura's just sort of with her to make sure she's okay. And we were like, yeah. oh, we've got to go and hold the taxi. Yeah, but they're just coming. Is that See you in a minute. So, update on Alara. Laura, very drunk. 